Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your boy Man K Man Kirit here in the building. And if you're new to this channel, please consider subscribing and turn on notification bell icon because much good content is yet to come. So guys, today I'm joined by a beautiful lady. They say you don't say it beautiful in Nigeria, you say it fine lady. I'm joined by a fine lady all the way from Nigeria. I'm gonna let her introduce herself. Hey guys, what's up? How y'all doing? This is Mira's world all the way from Nigeria. Mm -hmm. And right now I am in Mombasa with Man Kili. Man K Man Kili. So guys, today we'll be talking about how Nigeria thinks or feel or I don't know what to say, but we're gonna talk about what Nigeria thinks about Kenya and if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and let's go on with the video. Right. Blah, 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 blah. Welcome back to Mankili Pankei YouTube channel. Elvis Diddy, the king of YouTube. Yeah, diamond from the US. His name is Aisha. Hey, um, Salih. So, Miras. Yeah. But then you have a YouTube channel. Yeah, sure. What's, what's the name of your YouTube channel? Miras World. By the guys, I'm gonna leave the link below the description box, so make sure you go and check out out so you see the video that she has done here in Mombasa. So, is it your first time in Kenya or? Yeah, it's my first time in Kenya. And what is your experience? Oh, well, the first time I came, I landed at Nairobi. Mm -hmm. JKA. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Nairobi was super cold. Super at cold. first, I was enjoying the weather and all. I think I exposed myself a little bit and I got a bit ill. But now I moved to Mombasa and I'm loving everything about it. Mombasa people say it's hot and all. There's just sun here. It's still cool. Like The sun is not that yeah. hot and all. Because In of Nigeria, the I feel like the sun can fry eggs. Yeah. <laughs> fry eggs? <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But yeah, I'm loving I'm loving Kenya as a whole. Nairobi has its own good side. Mombasa has its own. There are so many things to see in Mombasa. Mm -hmm. I'm regretting why I didn't come here earlier. But next time when I come to um, Kenya, I think I'll spend more time in Mombasa because this place is dope. So, so you haven't talked about how people treat each other or treat, uh, they have treated you. Do you love it? Do you hate it? Or? Yeah. Um, so far, so good. I've not met any bad person mm -hmm. from the taxi drivers to the Airbnb hosts to friends to, to man killing <laughs> to, kill to his family. Oh, man, oh. Guys, his family, they are super dope. I like they hosted me this morning, they gave me food, they gave me chow and chai. all that. Chai. Mm -hmm. So, everyone I met this in this trip has been amazing. They've added color to my journey and i really 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 appreciate so in as much i've not in as much as i've not dealt with so many people the few i've dealt with i can say that kenyans are good people okay so i want to ask you something because you're the only nigeria here right now uh -huh. and i want you to represent all the nigerians in nigeria okay if you are a nigerian watching this video please subscribe to the channel <laughs> okay i just want to ask you Back in Nigeria, you guys know Kenya, right? Mm -hmm. And what do you think people think about Kenya from Nigeria? E.g. from you. Yeah? Fast runners. <laughs> Marathon. <laughs> Apart from that? How do you guys do that? I don't we know. We feel like Kenyans are fast runners mm -hmm. and we feel like they are really dark. We're really dark? Yeah. More than Southern Sudan people? No, not really. <laughs> <laughs> but you're really dark. Yeah. Uh-huh. What's that? In Nigeria, most of us are not too yeah, dark, you know, a bit light skin and all that. Mm. So sometimes when we see Kenyans, we can really identify that, oh, this is a Kenyan. Mm. So so can you say that Nigeria love, loves Kenya or the Nigeria people loves Kenya? Nigeria is a very versatile place. There are 200 million people in Nigeria. Nigerians travel a whole 200 lot. million. Yeah. <laughs> Nigerians travel a whole lot. Mm -hmm. And so far, so good. And I've never seen anywhere where Nigerians had issues with Kenya. I mean, oh. I mean Nigerians have had issues with South Africa because of the xenophobia, blah, 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 blah. I've never seen Nigerians having issues with Kenya. And I think there are a few Kenyans and Nigerians as oh. well. Wonderful. That was my next question asking you if you've ever seen any Kenyan I have that. not like dealt with one, yeah. but I've seen uh, a Ugandan staying in Ken in Nigeria who has Kenyan friends. Oh. But I've not like dealt with her Kenyan friends. I'm just friends with her. 
Here in Kenya, we have a lot of Nigeria people. Who... Nigerians are everywhere. Oh. Everywhere, in, everywhere. In fact, I've ever made a video eating Nigerian food in Mombasa. You wow. should go and check it out. I ate, a, I don't know, something called a chinongo. I don't remember. I don't remember. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. So, Miras, you have stayed in Kenya for how long? For almost a week now. So, you have tasted some Kenyan cuisine. Mm -hmm. Which one was your best? I've tested pilau, Ooh, I've pilau. tested uh, ugali, I've tested nyama choma, choma nyama. I've tested... It's just left with biryani. Of you haven't tested biryani? No, but I've tested it in India. In India? So I'm, I'm guessing it might be the same. Mm -hmm. Maybe. So, so, so... But I love nyama choma the most. Nyama choma to the world! Guys, you have the best nyama choma ever. So, you said you you've been in India? Yeah. So, you've been in Kenya today? Right now you are in Kenya? So how many countries have you been to? I've been to India, Benin, uh, Ghana, Kenya. I've been to four countries. And then I do transit in other countries. So I'm yeah. not counting them. You should count them. Should I count them? Yeah. Then I've been to Ethiopia, I've been oh, to Qatar, I've oh. been to Dubai. Oh. If I should count the transit. This mama, they, they yeah. have a lot of money. Uh, yeah. <laughs> they lie, I'm looking for money. Please go and watch my videos. We'll watch the ad. We'll let us make money. <laughs> <laughs> so so you, you've stayed in Kenya for around three days, right? Mm, like almost one week. Yeah. One five week? Days, five days. Uh, so, have you learned any Kiswahili word? Yeah, I've, I've learned Asante Sana. Uh -huh. I've learned Sawa. Sawa. I've learned Kupowa. Mambo. Mm. Say Poa. Mambo. Poa. Yeah, that's like high. Okay, I've uh, learned um, Jambo. Yeah, Jambo. Is that Jambo? Huh? Also, I've also learned. Um, Nakupenda. Guy, she loves me. Oh my god. <laughs> that that means you love somebody, Nakupenda. Oh, really? Yeah. So Mira, would you advise anybody to come to Kenya? Sure, sure. Mm -hmm. Kenya is a very dope place with so many um what would I call it? So many sightseeing uh, mm -hmm. places and recreational center you can vis visit. They have the number one wildlife in Africa. So I don't know what you're waiting for. If you ever want to visit East Africa, touch down Kenya first. Yeah, and, 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 and since you have been in Nairobi and a lot of people watching this maybe may, may, I just, may have just heard about Nairobi and they're surprised that you're in Mombasa. Can you tell them some of the things that you've seen in, in Mombasa that they will make them come? Yeah, the beachfront, guys. Mamangina. The be the Mamangina beachfront is to die for. The view is man, and it's so long. Yeah, it's very very long. The distance is something else. And then there is a ferry that carries people for free. Totally the free. The recreational centers here are almost are free. free. In Nairobi, they are super expensive. Expensive, yeah. yeah. So that's the comparison between Mombasa and Nairobi. You can tell them. Better. Yeah, and then it's, it's it's a little bit hot here. It's not. The weather is not super cold like uh, Nairobi. A lot of people are migrating here. So when I yeah. when I when I hopped in the SGR train, yeah. it was packed. Full. So many people are coming to Mombasa. What are they coming to do? I don't know because this because it's cool. today it's Indian. Oh, that's why. And also, what, what, how can you talk about the SGR? Do you have one in Nigeria? Yeah, we do. But did you love ours? Yeah, yeah, I think the only difference mm -hmm. with yours is that it's a little bit fast. Mm -hmm. And the terminals, they are beautiful. Ah, the terminals are super. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. And the security system is yeah. dope. It's too. very, very, I know. The, the security is very important in each and every place. So, guys, any, anything you want to tell people here? The last thing, we're coming to the end of the video. So, um. Caribou Mon. <laughs> Caribou Mombasa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anytime you visit Mombasa, this guy is your to go person. Make sure you reach out to him. He's gonna show you guys around. He is the bomb. Like seriously, I had fun today, and you know, just hit him up anytime you see yourself in Mombasa. Yeah. So guys, I really appreciate you Thank coming you. to Mombasa and getting in touch with me. Yeah. And if you're watching and you have to come, you want to come to Mombasa, just hit me up, and I will. I'll make sure I respond to each and every one of you. So guys, thank you for watching and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye. Ciao. What do you, you say? Bye in Nigeria. Bye. 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 Bye.